Hey guys, back with a quick mail day. Uh, very anticipated mail day for my self. Uh, I have only two pickups here, both from eBay. And I'm super excited about one of them because I, I do know what both of them are. So we'll get the first one. I guess you can say this is the smaller of the two. Uh, pickups and you guys know I'm collecting these uh I don't want to say they're all Hall of Fame but my favorite players that I've uh watched growing up you know just guys I liked watching and I'm trying to stick with like you know the whole on card auto thing but uh yeah so flip this around so this is four out of five obviously you can see the name He's up there in a lot of the receiving stats, as most of you would know. Uh, I'll change this top loader out, no big deal. But four out of five, so super short print from 88 to 2004. Autograph guaranteed. It's the uh, green foiled version of Tim Brown. So that's pretty sweet. One of the best receiver statistically ever uh yeah long career mainly with the raiders i think he went to a couple other teams after that but uh for short periods of time but so that's that and then funny story i'll try to make it quick i was everybody knows to go with my jerry rice auto i've been really wanting an Emmett Smith auto. You know, you got the leader all time in receiving. I would love to have the leader all time in rushing. And uh, so, about every two days, I look, you know, I try to look for a deal. One time I was within $5 of making a deal for an Emmett. And it was a sticker. And it just, I don't know, I just couldn't come to do what that price was. After I rethought about it. So anyway, the other day I was looking. I found an Emmett that I uh, really enjoyed. Seen the price. It wasn't a bad price whatsoever. It wasn't a... Uh, of course he's going to throw in extra stuff. Uh, so I think that would be the card. <laughs> so the funny story behind this is... It wasn't a best offer, or it was just a buy it now type thing, and I didn't see that card before. So, sometimes I go and contact the seller just to see if they are going to move at all, right? So, I went to the seller's name on eBay, and I happened to see that this was the username on there. Now, if you don't know, this is a huge Miami Dolphins fan here on YouTube. One of the biggest uh, tubers on here. Uh, Brad8671. And I'm like, what are the odds that this is the same YouTuber with the same exact name? So anyway, I messaged him on Facebook. Asked him if he was firm. Asked him if that was his card and if he was firm. And right away, he shot out an offer... That basically I could not refuse. I didn't even try to haggle at all with them. It was a very good deal. I even sent them five extra bucks for the shipping. Friends and family. So not only did he save uh, the 13%, 12 to 13% in eBay fees. You know, I don't think it. he took a big hit on it. I hope not. If he did, I uh, didn't want it to be that way. But. Yeah, so then I messaged him, then he says he's going to throw in a couple extra Titans, which I just bought a pretty nice card off you. You don't have to uh, send anything extra, but of course he does. What in the hell? So he does. So Brad, thanks, man. Uh, you did not have to send any extra. So we got Rashard Matthews out of 145. I was thinking like, oh, what the hell, man? You said literally a couple not no short print at a 25 Richard Matthews from Dunruss. It's a die cut. Dory Jackson at a 25. Now, if these are considered your throw ins, that is just absolutely insane once you see the card that I got. Derrick Henry and DeMarco Murray. 
These are beautiful cards. Oh my god, that's out of 15. What is wrong? Dude. And then I'm sitting here looking at what is on top of here. And a Janu Smith auto that I don't have. Which is pretty hard being. I don't know how I have about 35 of them. And that's out of 49. So I don't know why you threw in uh, this many goodies on top of this card, man. Like, you really, really did not have to. Ugh. Well, it's 75 out of 75, which you know I love how... I don't consider this an eBay 101, but I love it when the matching numbers are like that. They call them bookends, I think, in some... Uh, but look at that patch there. That two color there. It's thick, I can tell. Obviously, do not have this. Wow. Wow. Look at that one. Corey Davis again. Man, is that the number? Looks like that's almost where the eight, it looks like the eight. And if that is, that is just absolutely has to be the eight. And that one's also out of 49. So, uh, yeah, I did not expect uh, these cards to be throw ins. But that's two cards. Oh, man. 15, 25, 49, 75. Thanks, dude. Like, that enough was almost taken away from what I got here. Uh, but anyway, moment of truth. Again, Brad, before I show it, thanks for the deal. Very awesome of you. A uh, great price. And now I have a brother to go with. The all-time great Jerry. And yeah, so we'll slow roll this a little bit. So if anybody knows who that guy is, even though I've already said kind of in the video who it is, so we got Emmett Smith at a National Treasures of this year, 2017. Card looks sharp on the back. I mean, it, there ain't nothing wrong with it. I mean, it's a keeper anyway. It's not like him. And look at that beauty on card. 10 out of 10 because you that's, I swear to you, that's what attracted me to that card even more when I first seen it. Was uh that... And it looks even better now that it's here. Blue ink, which makes it even better. I mean, obviously it's not the impeccable, but I'm telling you, the price he shot me was so fair. I wasn't even going to hesitate. Because I knew about what I wanted to spend on an Emmett, at least on card. Being 10 out of 10, I mean, uh, and, that, and that's why throwing these on top of that is just, absolutely insane man but uh thank you for this card i mean just the irony of seeing a card i liked looking and then it was it happened to be you anyway just crazy how this card collecting world can be uh pretty small sometimes but so yeah there's your brother keeper now i got two of the hardest ones that i wanted to get and i'm very pleased with it so, yes, I'm super excited if you can't tell. I'm super excited just to get these cards. I like these more than I like this Tim Brown. But, uh, thank you, man. Uh, check out Brad8671 if you guys don't know who he is for whatever reason. Awesome content. Talks about the news in the NFL sometimes and just gets into breaks. High-end cards always and... Anyway, I'm done jabbering. But uh, thanks again, man. Uh, that's all I got, guys. So they'll probably all go downhill from here now that I got these two guys. I can't imagine getting much better than that. But yeah, thanks for watching. Also, just won uh, Alvin Kamara. Had a playoff auto for $12 and a Raz. So that's pretty sweet. It's out of playoff, but oh well. So that'll be here someday soon. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. See ya.